It's a uh, Saturday morning, and I'm kind of bored. I'm so bored, I am actually playing Nintendo Switch. Let me tell you that today, which I believe is February the 12th, you can get a game called Inside. And uh, it's a, for $1.99. It's a, it's a strategy puzzle game. But not a puzzle like connect the dots or something like that. Like you are, it, it's kind of an eerie setting. You're a person going through woods and across a farm on a path. And the controls are really basic forward, backwards, jump and uh, push and pull. And that's about climb. And that's about the only controls you have. And basically, people are trying to attack you, you, but you can't fight back. So you have to strategize on how to get past this problem. So you have to move things. You have to figure out how to start a diesel engine. Um, it's, it's kind of cool, and for $1.99, I think it's pretty fun. But anyways, what I'm getting ready to tell you, some people get kind of mad at me because... I'm one of those friends that I'm not going to lie to you. So if you're doing something bad or you're doing something wrong or if you ask for my opinion, you might be kind of surprised that I don't sugarcoat it. And uh, I don't want anybody sugarcoating anything to me. With that being said, I have a little thing that happened this morning. My microwave broke. It's a Samsung microwave. Uh, I went to go open up the door and I heard something click or snap and then I heard plastic hit the ground and I was like, oh crap. And uh, basically the, the part that holds the handle on the door broke. And uh, this is the lead in to the video on how I fix that and also why men have, real men by the way, have uh, little piles of junk all over the place. So uh, let's get started. When you wonder why a man keeps so much junk, I'm about to show you why. This little plastic piece broke off of the handle for my under cabinet mount microwave. That made the handle really loose, like it was about to break. And uh, not only is this little piece of plastic that probably didn't cost but a few pennies to make not available I'm gonna guess even if it was an available part you wouldn't be able to get it today with the supply chain shortages here's another piece of it let me show you how I fix this with my little pile of junk first you have to know that up here is where that piece of plastic went and basically what it is it's a, another piece of plastic for the handle that sticks through here and that piece of plastic that broke is like a spacer so with that spacer moving the handle was just free to move back and forth what I did was I found a nut in my pile of junk that was big enough to go over the plastic that sticks out to fill in the gap. And then I stuck two lock washers on the factory screw. Tightened it all down. And now the handle is solid. So, uh, so anyways... I consider myself to be an old school man. I mean, a new under cabinet microwave is probably three, four, five hundred dollars. Hard telling what it costs today. It might be a thousand dollars. But for the cost of one nut and two lock washers, that probably cost 
Well, I bought some nuts a couple of weeks ago, and they were 13 cents each, and the lock washers, I think, were 9 cents, so uh, 13 plus 18, what's that come to, 8, 9, 10, 11, 30, 31 cents, so uh, 31 cents in about 5 minutes of time, probably actually took me another 5 minutes going through my little junk thing here, the closest junk thing I had, I actually made it work. And a multi-tool fixed. And uh, I got to heat up my morning oatmeal too. So, works. Anyways, that's why man keeps little things of junk all over the place. Anyways, thanks for watching on this cold Saturday morning, middle of February. A couple of days before Valentine's Day. As always, God bless you, God bless your families, God bless your homesteads, learn how to be more self-sufficient.